much. So I I began following I think in early 2020. Mm. I saw a lady I've known in Ghana because I left Ghana like 20 years ago. So I saw a lady that I've known as a child mm. on your um, Facebook. So mm. I said, oh, why am money there? So I joined. And, um, in 2018, I lost my father in London, mm. and there was a big battle, a very, very big battle that I almost lost my mind. Mm. I couldn't cook. So I would come on every time, and Bishop said, there's somebody going through a court case, and honestly, I, I lost, I, my whole mind was, I didn't know, I was all over the place. Mm. So it was a long issue, one thing from here, one thing from there, and then in 2020, we decided to acquire our own place. But at the time, everything was so bad mm. from one thing to the other. So when I came on, I, I just put the phone on and I turned my back. So my children were playing. And I heard you say that there's a woman with braids. You mentioned the color and where I put the color and your back is turned and the sofas are brown. Wow. And said, so you were there and then I was yeah. speaking to you. Yeah. I was prophesying to you. I want to know yeah. when you are watching and I I describe you like that. How do you, how does it feel? <laughs> the thing is that at the got to one point I, I will come on and not comment because I've come on for God knows and there was no day God spoke to me. <laughs> Even though I know that in the atmosphere God was speaking, there was nothing specific. Right. So I'll be on the days where I'll be on with you from twelve midnight in the UK to four AM. On Zoom, praying uh -huh. with you, and nothing will be said. I know that for everything God is saying for all of us, but I wanted a specific right, word. Right, right. So I've done that severally, but I, I'll be honest. So my, even my brother says, you're always here and you don't hear anything. But that <laughs> particular day, I turned it on and my back was facing the phone. Uh-huh. And I've had You I had braids, you sat there. Be here. Uh-huh. But Go ahead. And you said there's a lady here in a brown sofa. With braids, this, describing the braids, your back is turned to your phone. And I, I just suddenly I realized, I said to my children, this must be me. <laughs> so I said to my mom, this is me, honestly, because everything, initially you mentioned somebody with braids, uh -huh. but the color was in me, then from here you came to me. And you said the sofa described the place, and you said God is restoring your glory. Why I believe it was that prior to that one, I had a dream, mm. and there was something in my hair and I, I, I began to comb that thing out. It mm. wasn't a good thing. Mm. So when I woke up and I came on and he said, God is restoring your glory, I just took it. So mm. I sent you a message on Messenger that I needed your paper out so I could sew into it. And I had it, uh, the Akosia Okuni one, but it wouldn't let me sew. And mm. I said to God, my heart is to really sew into this, but since it's not allowing me, I still take my prophecy. Mm. At the time, we had applied to buy a place, but we are all self-employed. Mm. And COVID came and they said self-employed people, they will have to do extra checks. Mm. So we'll go here, get something, we'll go here, they'll stop us, we'll go there. Then the moment God said to you that he's restoring the um, estate, um, the sales office phone, then said, you guys can now go through. Wow. So I kept on praying, kept on praying, and then... The Lord Himself handed the keys over, and I've been trying to put this testimony across. So when I came on yesterday, and I saw people testifying, I had to now do my because it has been long um, in coming. Oh, glory be to God! We thank God. Bless God. And, and you know God. the anointing of God is on your life. Amen. You have to get serious with God. God wants to use you. Amen. So get serious with God. You are not fasting as you should. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> so, God wants to use you. God wants to use you. Yeah. You're going to start prayer, and it's going to grow in your house. I started one in 2019. Then okay. COVID came, and we stopped. Okay. So, start it again. The word of the Lord okay. to you, start it again. It's going, okay. to, it's going to be five people for about four months. And then okay. it will break to 20. 40 okay. and then you will find your own okay. place and I would like to come and, and, and preach for you when you have your own oh, place <laughs> yeah. I, would like to... <laughs> I would like to come and preach for you but amen. start it again start it